not understanding a uh, pretty little thing, PLT. Like what what happened in the sewing room? Like who who's responsible? I, I... Hey y'all, um, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Dean. If this is your first time here, go ahead and do yourself in your favor and hit that subscribe button, like, comment, and share this video. And today we have a haul. Pretty little thing. So, this is my first time ordering some pretty little thing. I'm gonna go ahead and try these pieces on and give my honest review. This video is not sponsored in any way, shape, or form. My favorite is my own coin, honey. So, if that's something you're interested in watching, then go ahead and stay tuned. Okay, so the top I have is called the, I'm just reading from my packing slip. It's called the Sand West Coast printed t-shirt and this is a size small. Um, the jeans are, these are the only pair of jeans I have so I'm gonna try this on with all of the tops that I have because I have a lot of tops. And the jeans are the black denim jeggings and these are in a size 4. Everything I have is either in a size US4, UK8, and smalls on all the tops in case I forget to mention it or whatever. So the jeans are pretty high waisted. I don't know if you can see um, from that angle. if. It's not looking right, though. I'm gonna go ahead and do it in the mirror. But I mean, it's cute, it's basic. Uh, the shirt is a little thin, not see through, but just a little thin. It's not like as thick as um, the tops I got from Misguided, if you saw that haul. If you didn't, I will link it below. But yeah, it's, I mean, pretty basic, standard. It's cute, or whatever get the job done but yeah so um there's the head okay so what is this called so this top is called the white basic cotton crop t-shirt and it's kind of like ripped right here at the bottom so it fits really, really nice it's like really really snug um throughout or whatever it kind of goes at a decent length like too much of your back is not showing and too much of your, your tummy area isn't showing it either so it's like mom friendly uh fupa friendly all of that friendly and i actually wouldn't i still wouldn't wear it like this even though i mean if you're comfortable like this then do your thing just depending on the, the situation, you know what I'm saying? I may or may not. But either way, I got this top to go over it. And this is called the Black Checked Oversize Shirt. And this is in a UK size 8, a US 4. And I've noticed on Pretty Little Thing, like other people's hauls, they have like this little situation here um i guess to prevent people from just trying stuff on and returning or whatever so if you want to return it then don't cut this i'm not returning this uh, so i'm about to cut this in a second but let me just show you how this how this look on or whatever the vibe i was going for because i got a few trips coming up and you know i just wanted to be on like some some West Coast vibe situation. So, yeah. So, it is really, really cute. I gotta get, hold on. Man, listen. I gotta get rid of this. Hold on. Okay. So, yeah. I had to take that little bag off, honey. I just, I couldn't do it. But, yeah. So, it has two little buttons here. You can button up. 
and it buttons all the way down so you can wear it you know open like this or you can cleanse it i think i could even get away with wearing this honestly as like a shirt dress because i'm not that tall if you're taller than me then you probably couldn't but if you're my height or shorter you could definitely get away with wearing this as like a, a shirt dress with some heels or something um, so yeah, so I plan on wearing it kind of like this or even, you know, back in the day, we used to do the whole attire around the waist situation. So yeah, that would be cute too. I just, you know, wearing your waist, chilling, effortless, glam, whatever. Do all the little gold jewelry, uh, you know whatever your little jewelry is but yeah i really really like this whole outfit and i kind of bought it to wear it together exactly like this so yeah so that is this okay so the next thing i have is actually a two-pack so it's actually the one i'm wearing and this one here um this one is called the basic two-pack camel and stone so this is the stone one and this is the camel one. So it's the exact same top, uh, just different shades. Disclaimer, I don't know if I said this, but this is pretty much neutrals and new tones. Um, I don't have so much color, so that's what this haul is basically. I needed uh, neutrals and basics and stuff like that. So yeah. So this is a stone one. Um, it fits really, really well. Uh, I got this in, like I said, a US size four and everything. It fits really, really well. The material is, it's not the thickest, but it's not the thinnest either. Like, it's like, right in between like for two of them because it's a two pack and i paid how much for two of these um it was 15 dollars i'm gonna double check that because that don't sound right that definitely don't sound right but i know it's like no more than like 10 ten dollars or something like that for both of these um but yeah that definitely don't sound right but yeah so i got two of them and what i really really like about these um how they have the the plastic uh lining thing for you know trying stuff on because some people be nasty and trifling like if you ever Rent. If you've ever gone somewhere and tried on like a bathing suit or whatever, and it's like, am I the only one that just be feeling like, did somebody before me try this on and put this right up on the, they stuff and just put it right back on the rack? Cause anyway, so yeah. So I have these two. I'm not gonna try this one because I mean it's the exact same one. It's just a different color. But I mean the material is pretty like I good. Like I said, it's pretty good. Um, kind of sort of see through a little bit. Not like see right through. Like you can't see what color bra I'm wearing or anything. But yeah. So I have these two. Um. So yeah, that's that. Oh, I lied. So it is, uh, I don't know if I mentioned, it is a thong and it is a snap um, closure. So it is a thong um, bodysuit and a snap closure. But yeah, so, okay. So this is called the Brown Basic Jersey Crew Neck Fitted T-shirt. All of that to just say a brown t-shirt. So yeah, so this is um, that. It's not a bodysuit, but I mean, I would just go ahead on and take it in, make it look like a little bodysuit or whatever. And yeah, so this top is actually, 
exact same color as the other bodysuit that I have. So I didn't really notice that, but whatever. This is the t-shirt, that's the sleeve of the shirt. You see how I needed both of them, right? But yeah, so this one fits pretty well too. Um, pretty much the same material as the bodysuits. Um, not too thin, not the thickest, right in between. You know, you get what you pay for it. This stuff was really, really inexpensive. Um, and from what I see in here, they always have like discount codes and stuff like that. So yeah, this, I mean, it's a basic. You can dress it up, down. Can't really say too much else about it. It's what I needed, what I wanted, and it met my expectations. So yeah, so this is a go. I'm actually really, really satisfied with everything um, that I have so far. I only have two more tops and then I have two dresses and that will be it for this little haul. I didn't get too much stuff because like I said, this is my first time trying them out and I just wanted to see what it was hitting for real quick. So they might be getting, they might be getting my coins a little bit more often than I'd like to. You know what, we're gonna just keep it moving. I'm gonna keep it moving to the next thing, to the next thing. Okay, so this is called the Shape Chocolate Brown Sleeveless Silky Bodysuit. Now, a couple of the items on there said shape, and this was one of them. Um, I didn't know what that meant, to be completely honest, but I kind of feel it now. It kind of pulls you in a little bit more, like shapewear, hence the name, duh thing like slow moment but yeah so this is a little thicker than the other um tops I showed so if you're looking for something that's gonna like you know suck you in a little bit more support but everything then look for the, the items that say shape um at least that's what I gather from it because this top is it, it has a little bit more smoothing, like it's more seamless, and yeah, it's, it's a lot more seamless. So yeah, this is a bodysuit as well. Same as the others, um, it's a thong with a snap um, closure or whatever. And this is, uh, no, I thought it was a racer back, but yeah, it kind of is. It's kind of sort of a racer back. I don't have it snapped at the bottom because I ain't got time. But um, yeah, if you you know wear it correctly, then it'll be a lot more seamless than how I have it. But yeah, this is probably like um, the best quality. This and the, the button up shirt. So I'm just gonna throw on the last top that I have, which is this sweater and it's called the ultimate oversized sweater in light blue. So I'm just gonna throw this over the top of this. And yeah, this is a size four as well. So let's see. I'm about to be like a hot mess when I pull this over my hair. But whatever. So, yeah, so this is what this looks like. And I honestly just got this because I don't have any like casual sweaters um, for like the fall, winter, whatever you call it. We don't really have a winter here in Louisiana. So I tend to wear more sweaters than like coats and jackets because I don't like a whole bunch of stuff on me anyway I don't like feeling restricted like that so yeah so I just needed um I just needed some like basic sweaters I just wanted to try this one out I don't know because normally I just get them from Walmart to be completely honest but yeah I saw this one and I like the color um 
I don't know why I'm just drawn to this baby blue color. Like ever since I had my son, my youngest little boy, is like I just be drawn to this color. I don't know why. Uh, even you know, since I got pregnant with him, I've just been drawn to this color. So it's pretty, it's cute, it's not as oversized as I would like for it to be. I feel like once I wash it, it's gonna shrink. Cause right now it's like exact. Like I'm five three. This is a US size four. I wish it was just a little bit bigger. So if you're looking at this item and you want it to fit oversized, I would say size up. Like a four is pretty much my, my true size. Um, in these clothes, you know, from what I gather. So I wish I would have gotten like a, a six, maybe even an eight to be completely honest. I wish I would have gotten like an eight in this. Cause right now it's just like, I mean, I got some space in it or whatever, but it's just, I just wish it was a little bit more oversized, but yeah. So the quality of it is pretty good. Other than that, it's not too thin. Um, yeah, it's not itchy or whatever. It's not too thin, it's not too thick. So it's like perfect for Louisiana fall, winter, cause we really don't have it. So, so yeah, this is cute or whatever. Okay, so somehow I forgot about the this little dress here, literally. Uh, I knew it was short on the website, but baby, baby, this is a little thing little, but it's cute. So this is called, what is this called? Okay. All right, so I forgot about this dress. Um, yeah, I forgot that I had this one to be honest. So um, this is just called the black long sleeve bodycon dress. Um, it's really, really short, like really, really short. Um, but the good thing about it, you can dress this up, down, you can wear it the same way as the other ones, you know, with some sneakers, some heels, um, a little jacket, you can even put, um, that little button up over it if you wanted to, like you could really, really do a lot with a little black dress and you can really like never have enough. So that's why I got this one just as another alternative. Like I have um, different lengths, like my other ones are a lot longer. This is probably my shortest one. I ain't pulled out a dress like this and since, <laughs> baby, yeah. So this is cool for like a girl's night out or you know, something like that or even just, you know, a little quick run to, so Walmart, the grocery store or something, if you have a little jean jacket over it and you know, you could have on a baseball cap, whatever, like whatever, you could really do a lot with basics like this. So one thing I will say, um, like the material of it is kind of not how I thought it was going to be from the, the website. I thought it was going to be more like that just like untextured spandexy cottonish material if that makes sense like a long sleeve cotton t-shirt with a little bit of stretch to it that's what i thought this material was going to be like but it's actually more of like like somewhat slinky ish i don't know can like tell on camera but um yeah nonetheless it's still cute um i do remember the exact price of this uh, dress this dress was four dollars which is why i put it in my cart because i mean i'm like it's four dollars like <laughs> you know what i'm saying so i mean considering that 
and all that you can do with it, it's really, you can't beat it, you know what I'm saying? So, if this is not really a thing, which for me on a day to day, running around with my little, little one, this is not really practical, but you can go ahead on and throw this over it real quick and I already said I could wear this as like a, a dress a shirt dress so like the shirt is literally longer than the dress so yeah so you can dress this down up like this could just be another little layering piece for it if you wanted to because I mean it is pretty short and as I'm like standing on my toes it is like riding up or whatever so yeah, just keep that in mind if you get it, or you could just size up. This is a four, like my normal size. Maybe if I would have gotten like a six, it probably wouldn't be so thin and tight, but probably I would just use it as like a layering piece with this if I wanted to wear this as a dress. Um, so yeah, like I said, it was $4, so can't beat it, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Okay, so this is called the Stone Rib Short Sleeve T-Shirt Dress. And it's literally exactly like what it says. It's stone, it's red, it's short sleeve, and it's a T-Shirt Dress. The only thing I will say about this it's not like I don't know if I just didn't pay attention because it's right there in the description that it's ripped but I thought it was going to be like a regular like t-shirt t-shirt um but yeah it's some cute basic um I'll wear this pretty much like I've been saying kind of more on the casual side so yeah it you know, you can dress it up, down, whatever. It's not thin or, you know, see-through. It is like that uh, polyester, like cotton blend, like bouncy material. Um, but yeah, it's so cute. I don't have any issues with it whatsoever. Um, like the material just feels more like it wants to be more dressed up like on the website it looked really really like casual like t-shirt t-shirt casual that's what I thought it was going to be um this is like that kind of slinkyish, um like dressy uh shirt material but it's so cute um just not what I expected but yeah it's so cute it's really really soft it's not itchy or you know like a weird fabric or anything so you see me hold on wait let them hoes get it to it right quick you see me yes hair on fleek all right y'all so this little dress here got me feeling some type of way okay yeah um Okay, so this right here is called the girl. Listen, where, where, where you at, girl? Where you, where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Just, okay, this is called the Sage Green Brush Thread Button Front Medaxi Dress. So it hits like right at like your calves or well, my calves. I'm um, five three and. One thing I will say, this material. This material is not what I expected it from looking at the website. Um, I don't know, I expected the material to be more of like a ribbed kind of shirt material. This is more like a ribbed light, light sweater material, if that makes sense. Um, so yeah, that's the only thing I will say. It is really, really soft. 
I will say that it's really, 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 really soft. It almost feels like, almost like a thin, thin corduroy, if that makes sense. So yeah, it's really, really soft, not itchy. Um, it's not see-through from what I can see in my mirror right now. These are real buttons, so you can, you know, button it up all the way or, you know, undo it in that little, you know, decollete, cleavage, show or whatever. I wish, I don't know why, I wish it had like the little holes right here, because I don't, I don't know. But yeah, other than that, I mean, it's cute or whatever, you know, a good little date night. You could dress this up or down. You could put, you know, a jean jacket on with this with some tennis shoes, some bands, some, you know, Adidas, whatever. Or you could put this on with some cute little heels for date night. Uh, so yeah, I just needed, you know, like I said, basics and neutrals. And I don't know if you could tell, but this is green. It's like a really, really light, light, light like very very muted green but green nonetheless um but i don't know if it's picking up on camera and yeah it's honestly i can't even really see it that well in person to be completely honest like i'm just saying that because they say it's green but it honestly looks greener on the website i will say that it looks a lot greener on the website than it does in person and probably than it does on camera it looks more like a stone to me i don't really see green but i don't know maybe i'm colorblind y'all let me know what y'all think but uh yeah it's cute it's you know it's gonna get the job done baby but yeah we're gonna go ahead on and try on this next one <laughs> You know, you know. I'm really, I... <laughs> okay. Okay. So... This is so weird. It is so weird. I don't know if y'all can see what I'm seeing, but... Alright. If I stand up straight, do you see how... Like, this sleeve is wider than this one. Like, I don't know what's going on with this. I was good up until, cause the color, I love the color. I love, it's the exact same dress as the other one, it's just a different color. Um, I mean, what is, what, what is this about? Like, who was this made for? Like, who, 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 who got one big arm and like, I don't, I don't understand why this, this one is so baggy. Like, are y'all seeing this? Like, are, can y'all see this? This shit. <laughs> like, this. It's so much bigger and loose. Like, I swear I just took this out of the package. Like, I'm the first person that I know of to wear this. So, I don't know what this is about. This is low key pissing me off because I really, yeah. Other than that, um, it's the exact same material as the other dress. It's not the thickest. I will note that again. Um, yeah, I'm just mad that I had to, because I mean, this is my last piece, so I'm basically ending the video with this piece. And I had such high hopes for it. I was low-key saving it for last, because I'm like, you know, this smoke deliciousness, just, we're going to bring it home like that. And then y'all play me with this one big-ass balloon sleeve. So I'm not understanding a uh, pretty little thing, PLT, like what? what happened in the sewing room like who who's responsible I, I i don't know but um yeah so other than that the dress is it's it's cool or whatever i guess i could 
Cause I'm not, I don't return stuff. Like I'm not about to send it back and go through the hassle, all of that. So I guess I can kind of like, like, even with rolling the sleeves up, you can see like the difference in how baggy this is. Like what is, what is that about? I don't, like what is that? I don't know who who did it, but anyway. So yeah, I would probably be confined because that was that's gonna bother me. I probably uh, have to wear this with like a jean jacket or something over it to hide the fact that this one sleeve is just stretched out like this for some reason. So yeah. Um, let me go ahead and gather myself, gather my thoughts, and I'm gonna go ahead and give my final thoughts for Pretty Little Thing. Okay, so um, I just kept this little dress on because it is what it is at this point. So, um, overall, I will say that for the price, of everything um my total that's my total on here i think my total was like one 100... one something it's not on here but whatever yeah um my total was like a little over a hundred dollars like not too much over a hundred dollars and i got let's see I got a few things. I got one, two, three, six, seven, eight, ten, twelve things. So I would say that's not that's not bad, honestly. And the quality, with an exception of this last dress, um, everything was pretty okay. Nothing like blew me away. Nothing was like, oh my god, it's like the best ever because I've been blown away by quality. Um, but it was really, really inexpensive and it's trendy items and stuff like that. So for the money, it was pretty good. Now shipping, I ordered this on September 26th. I placed my order. Today is October 11th while I'm recording this. I'll try and have this video up either today or tomorrow <clears throat> but um yeah I got my order on October 10th so I got it um, yesterday so it took about 14 days to get to me which is not bad um, but with shipping the uh, tracking number and everything that they gave me for some reason it wouldn't show like once it got to the US it showed that it cleared customs and at one point it was showing me that it was in Jamaica and it was supposed to be here like a while ago um, and it was, it was like a couple of days late from the date that they said that it would be here, but not by much, not by much, like maybe give or take two or three days. So the shipping was pretty good. It was just more so like the tracking number communication part. That was not an issue for me personally, because I'm like, you, I know you're going you're gonna to deliver my stuff, because um, if not, they would going to have a problem, but you know. I give people a chance to get my stuff to me because I understand, you know, with COVID and everything, you know, they have, you know, issues with that or whatever. So I wasn't really worried about that. And like I said, shipping took about two weeks, which is not bad. That's pretty standard for most um, websites. So all in all, with an exception of this last piece, this last little dress, I would say that it was pretty decent. Um, will I place another order? 
probably, yeah, <laughs> I probably will. Um, do I recommend it? Yeah, if you're looking for some trendy pieces, affordable prices, um, I mean, pretty little thing. I've been seeing them on YouTube, like people doing reviews for like the longest and I've never ordered. So I just was like, let me just order and see what they're about. So if you just want to see what they're about, just see, you know, test them out or whatever. I would say then go ahead. Um, but yeah, all in all, I would say if I would have to, if I would have to rate it, um, one through 10, my overall experience, I would say, I would give them like an eight. I would give them an eight because for the most part, my pieces, they look like they look online. They, you know, they weren't like deceiving or anything like that. So I would say for the most part, I got what I ordered. I got what I paid for. So yeah, that is all. All right, y'all, so if you have made it this far, number one, thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't. If you made it this far and you haven't subscribed yet, like what, 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 you, what you're doing with your life right now, like for real. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you like videos like that, that like, uh, like this, then go ahead and hit the like button, comment any of your questions, comments, concerns whatever let me know what you think about the pieces what was your favorite piece are you doing like the neutral thing like everybody else this fall and winter um because i know i'm hopping on that bandwagon myself but yeah um go ahead and subscribe like comment share this video and stay tuned for more because i have plenty 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 more coming up in store and until next time bye dolls